So I had a dream in around 2012 to 2014. I can't remember exactly when. I'd have to go in my notes. And I have like seven books and I can't find it right now. So the dream was about Beyonce. And it was a really scary dream. Um, it woke me up out of my sleep. I saw her. And she was beautiful. She was, you know, in her in her makeup. And she was getting ready to perform. And she was getting ready to get on stage. And as she was climbing the stairs, she accidentally fell. And she was really embarrassed. And she didn't want to perform anymore. But there was this invisible force that pushed her onto stage. And once she got on stage, she transformed suddenly into this other person, other thing. It was very demonic. Um, she had this long curly black hair. It was down below her waist. And she had these jagged, jagged teeth. And her mouth was chomping the whole time. Like she was getting ready to devour anything and anyone in her way. And she had this dark skin, like um, her skin totally suddenly turned very dark, like uh, the goddess Kali, the Indian goddess of, um, I don't really know exactly. I know it's death and rebirth or something like that, or um, fertility, I'm not sure. But she transformed into this this other woman or demonic figure, and she, when she began to dance, it was very unnatural. She was bending her back all the way back like it was like she should have broke her back and she was bending her knees in a way that was unnatural <clears throat> going very fast and up and down and then it woke me up out of my sleep and I I just know that this dream is to pray for her because I remember watching an interview where she talked about a spirit coming over her and that she can't perform or do the acts that she does without this spirit this alter ego, Sasha Fierce. So I've never had dreams about anybody else until 2012. I also had a dream about Obama and um, I have a video of it on my channel, but I always grew up with dreams, prophetic dreams for myself where God would warn me and he prevented me from a lot of things and from a lot of embarrassing situations. And I'm so thankful for that. And it's always been in my family, these prophetic dreams where with my brothers and my sisters and there's nine of us and my mom and my dad. And I just always knew that there was someone looking out for us and looking out for me. And so I know that God is really calling out to her because I've ever since then, it's been years now, it's 2022 now. And so, so many people have had dreams about her to just, God is really crying out to her, calling to her. Jesus really wants to save her. And she could be such a great testimony to so many people, millions and millions of people and I just, I don't know if she'll ever see it, but I hope she does. And she really just understands how much love there is for her. Even though she may be deep in whatever she's in, witchcraft or whatever the occult, it doesn't matter. There's so many people that have repented and have gone out of the occult and are now warriors for Christ and have come to learn and understand the love of Christ and have been transformed by it. So I'm just praying that she really, really starts to seek and ask and that's the way it starts we have to ask we have to ask god we have to seek him and even if we just say god help me jesus help me god help me jesus help me if we just say that that will be that is that is one of the strongest most tremendous and poignant words we can say because a lot of times we don't know what to say and the holy spirit knows what we need and understands what we can't even say and so i just if you can pray for her, that would be great. We, that's not too late. She's alive. And while we're alive and breathing, you know, it's better to be a dog that's alive than a lion that's dead. Because when you're dead, you know. <sighs> Anyways, I just wanted to say that and post it finally because it's been years. So if you could pray, please pray. May she pray. May she just repent and find Jesus and may people send Jesus, may people, may Jesus send angels and people to just keep calling out to her, keep, keep sending her to, to ask and seek. All right. Thank you.